There we go. Do the first one there. And <laughs> I don't get it. Why do you buy things and then shred them? What is going on guys? Dre here and welcome back to the carnival. Today we're back in the coin game and we are going to be checking out the rest of the carnival today and hopefully we can earn some pretty major prizes because that's what I'm all about. We have $241 to our name right now. Oh, I hate this already. I hate spinning rides in real life. I didn't expect to hate them just as much in the game, but this is actually... Oh, okay, keep my head spinning one way. I can't do it. Oh, God. Okay, you know what? I'm actually getting off of it. I'm done already. But yes, if you missed the last episode, the carnival has made its way to the coin game. And uh, we checked out about half of the games and rides last episode. We're going to be checking out the rest today. And we're going to spend all our money, or at least hopefully we'll spend 241 bucks. see what we can earn with that money, and see if we can profit once again playing carnival games. Because that just, that, that shouldn't happen, but for some reason it does in this game, and that's great. Uh, so we did play some of them in the last episode. If you do want to check out that episode, link will be in the description. Uh, so we're going to skip a lot of the ones that we already played. We might go back to them if they are the big winners, uh, but I do want to check out, obviously, all the games. So we have this... I don't even know what this one's called. Lilypad Toss. So is this like those ring games with the bottles, kind of? That's probably what it's going to be. So red equals one credit, blue equals two, and yellow equals three. Can we go for the big old three? First shot, boom, goes the dynamite. That was actually close. Okay, so I don't really know how much to hold. Oh, I actually... There we go. We got one already. Okay, this isn't going to be too bad. I'm actually getting very close to where I'm aiming. Yellow one in the back. Okay, that, that was a little too far. Oh, oh, another red. All right, I'll take it. Two credits. Uh, this has got to be probably one of the harder games. And some for some reason, I seem to be quite a natural at it. Now, I don't know how many credits we need. Okay, so actually, we can get the crayon already if we want to. Obviously, I want to go for the big prizes every time. Uh, so we're going to hit done here and try and earn some more credits. Oh, got it! And I actually aimed for that one, too. Oh, that felt actually really, really good. Okay, we got one more. I'm going to go for that middle yellow. Oh, actually, I guess the, there was one in my jar, but I guess that one didn't count. That's okay. We got five credits now, so we can get the I'm big so fish. And I haven't gotten the cat yet, so we may as well I'm get the so cat pillow as well. All right. Well, it's not often you get two plus prizes in one game, but uh, we did it today, and we're going to put those things in our inventory and sell them later. All right, this is a game I've never actually seen. It's called Lucky Duck. I'm assuming maybe just ducks float and you pick them up. I, I don't know. We'll see what happens here. No idea what this one is. Okay, so yeah, this is a total game of luck. Uh, which duck? Which duck? Which one? You know what? The one going backwards. That's definitely going to be a good one, right? Damn it. Well, this game just isn't fun at all, man. All right, I'm going to try it again. <laughs> there's nothing like a random game of luck where there's no skill involved. You literally just pick up a duck. Not a huge fan of this one. Oh, my God. Seriously? All right, middle guy. Come on, buddy. Jesus. I am so unlucky. I don't know what, what the win percentage is on this, but I am spending way too much money here. Okay, come on. Come on. There we go. One prize credit. I got one, so I'm assuming it goes one to three. Pink cone for four? I've never seen that thing, so you know I gotta go for it now. There's gotta be better than a one star. This is just ridiculous. I've had to lose at least ten in a row now. And the moment I talk, I get another prize credit. All right, we just need two more. We're at $207 already, so I spent quite a bit of money on this. Oh, God, I hope this thing's worth it. Come on. Oh, two in a row? All right, maybe I should just keep talking. You know what? This guy's speeding through. I feel like he doesn't want to be picked, which means there we go. We got the big three, and that was three in a row after, like, I swear, 12 failures. So, all right. Can't complain now because there is indeed more than one credit in there. Now, we have two more credits. So, what do I want? Bounce ball or, uh, well, actually, yeah, the bounce ball because I think I already got the cramp. Jesus. Why are you guys so loud here? Okay, there we go. I really hope this thing's worth it. I don't think it really is. But in the inventory we go it goes, hey, we'll figure out how much it's worth. Where'd my bouncy ball go? Oh, God. It's actually... Uh-oh. 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 Oh, there, one, one, oh dude. Here. You can actually play with it. Oh, this is amazing. And also, I noticed I have a gun. Don't know where it came from. I also have a flashlight. That makes sense. But does this... What does this do? <laughs> Wait, is this like a, a sticky gun? Oh, does it actually stick? I couldn't actually see it. 
Oh, yeah, it is. Right up, Wait, what right is that? Up, right I don't know what this thing is. I don't know why I have it, but I'm not complaining about it. All right, it's racing time. And the first rule of racing is delete your competition. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought we just bet on the race. This is those water games where you got to get in the hole. Okay, and it's a corgi race, or is that a wiener dog? All right, which one do I want to go for? Who, who am I feeling? Number three. Shoot the target, is anybody on number three? I would like to use this one, please. Uh, it doesn't look like I can. I, I can only choose five. Well, that's no fun. Okay. All right, folks. Grid's all set about to be underway. Here we go. We have to aim for that middle target. Oh, oh, and it moves. It moves. Okay. Oh, God. I am not good at FPSs, so this is actually good training right now. Come on, baby. I have no idea. I'm not looking at the dog, so I don't know how I'm doing. I hope it's somewhat well. I feel like I'm somewhat consistent at least. Come on, baby. Did I win? Oh, I did win! Wait, no, I didn't. Who was that? No, number three won it, but I got one credit, so I guess you get a little bit for second place. Let's try again. We have to win this, man. I did win! Okay, I'm pretty sure that was a win for me. That was really close between me and number six. Uh, are you playing? You're the damn owner. You can't play. That's cheating, dude. Okay, what can we get? You know what? I don't think I... Did I get the cat pillow? Why is the snake only two here? The other game we played, it was three. Um, you know what? I'll take the cat pillow. We already got the, the, the snow cone, so I'm, I'm happy with that. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna keep moving on here. Uh, you know what? I wouldn't mind a nice cold lemonade, you know? Got, 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 gotta refresh yourself from time to time. What's up, well, dude? I don't do amusements. So I can help you. I, at lemonade. Give me your really expensive lemonade. All right, let me get that fresh squeeze. Juice Master 5000 XL. I hope it's, I hope it's a good one. For five dollars, this better be amazing. There better, there better be gold flakes in my lemonade. Jesus. All right. So, uh, I'll just drink it. There we go. And this lady, I mean, she can drink. It is gone, as you can see. <laughs> All right, everybody likes a pirate ship. Take a break from the games for a second here and get on the old pirate ship. And let's see if we can kill ourselves. Hey, friend. Oh, I can't. I can't use my gun. That's no fun. Now, is this a pirate ship that does the loop, or does it just go up like this? Still kind of horrifying, but it's always fun when they can actually do the loop. I gotta say, this would be an amazing game in VR, especially with all these rides now, because they're actually good rides. Uh, it's just, when you're actually just sitting here, it's not as fun as, as, as real life. That's kind of obvious, but, uh, yeah, with VR, I think the immersion would actually play well to this. So, yeah, it doesn't look like it's gonna do the loop, unfortunately, and, th and that's no fun. I want to see children fall out of this and whatnot. Okay, and I think this is the final game, the one that's probably gonna be the hardest. Three shots for five bucks. Any new prizes here? Three doesn't look like it. Is that a, what the hell is that thing, like a giant corn kernel? I don't, I don't even know. All right, so let's try it out. I mean, I think everybody knows how this one works. You get a shot in, you get a point. All right, here we go. Boom goes the dynamite, and it's in. Oh, my God. This is going to be so freaking hard. No, man. I am not going to be able to do this. Come on, baby. Wait, what? I'm not even I'm not even getting close. How do I shoot it so far? The basketball right below the net, where does it go? That's what I always like to figure out. That's actually really close. So if we put it below maybe the wins text, and it was it went to a bit to the left, so there we go. Let's see this. Ooh, I think that's good. We just gotta move it over a bit. It's all about finding a spot in the distance where you can aim consistently and figuring out, oh, maybe that is a little bit too high. Maybe we gotta drop it down even more. Okay, this is, this is gonna take a while for me to figure out the zone, but when we do, we're gonna earn lots here. I'm going way lower now. I'm getting close, but I still haven't landed one in. That looks good. What? What ball? Come on, man. <gasps> there we go. One game credit. One freaking credit. You better get the big prizes for one credit with this one. Uh, can we do two in a row? Generally, I, if I do one, I do two. Oh, no. That was close, though. Uh, I don't know if I want to do more of this. I want to see what, what, what the prizes are going to be, though. So, final ball. This looks good. Yeah, there we go. Okay. You just got to complain a bit, and then, then it works. All right, what can we get? Again, actually, look at that. They're all actually one, so this might be profitable. Stuffed coin I actually haven't gotten, so let's get that. And I want the kernel. I want, no, I want the... Oh, it's a salt lamp. Okay, I want the salt lamp as well. There we go. Thanks for throwing it there, buddy. And I think that is officially all the games. So, uh, yeah, we pretty much checked them all out. Now, I'm thinking 
probably the most profitable one for me is going to be the roll game. The roller, as it's called. It's $1 a shot. 150 shots, though, they take forever. So we'll do this for a bit, see what we can win. Uh, because, yeah, this one I've pretty much mastered, so we should be able to... Bam! Right there. That's it. That's it! Told you. I'm, I, I'm just a natural at this game. But mind you, you only get one... And what does it cost to actually, is it, oh, it is, <gasps> this fish, I don't think this was here before, for six, that's got to be worth uh, so much money, so we are going to go for the big six fish, that is by far the most expensive item in this whole place, and there it is, I think, oh, no, that might be too fast, I think that's too fast, oh, stay, yeah, we got it, I think I only screwed up, like, two, maybe three, for all six of these, and you know we're getting the big fish pink. All right, we're gonna take a break from this because uh, it, it, it isn't very fun when you get it every time, I'm gonna be honest, uh, but look at this. Are you jealous, kid? Do you want this thing? Once again, I'm not giving it to anybody because these things are worth lots of money, and we need to make money, man, because I need to buy more carnival games. Now, one game I didn't actually earn any prizes on, I think I got one point, and that's it, is Coin Dozers. I want to see, maybe this has the best prizes, I don't know. We're, we're testing it out today, and Coin Dozers fun, so... There's really only one coin, though? This seems like a really hard game. I mean, you have to move all these coins. Okay, another one just popped out, so it just seems to randomly happen where they pop out. And the problem is, I gotta bring these things all the way down to the end, and I only get 20 coins to do it. That's gonna be a challenge. Wait, you can stop the pusher? Oh my god, thanks for reminding me! Okay, well that adds a lot to this game. I didn't- I'm, I've only played this game like once or twice. So it looks like, yeah, I can just fill this thing up. Alright, so we're gonna do that. We're gonna do a nice wave over here. Oh, this is such a cool game. Look at that balancing act. Jesus. Alright, that should be good. Let's see what happens here. Oh yeah, that's a nice wall right there. Come on, baby! We got two that are really close. Okay, so I got four left. I'm gonna spread these really far out, and we should hopefully at least get one of these. Oh, look at that. The balancing act of these coins sometimes. There we go. That was actually really good. And the final push. Come on, baby. Yeah, I knew we'd get it. All right, we got a 2-1 right there, too. We, we obviously can't stop now. So it is another pink fish. We don't have the carny mirror, though, so I think I'll buy that as well. Uh, I have one credit right now. I thought, well, I had another one, I thought, from the original episode. I guess not, though. Yeah, there we go. First try, the big two came down. So I got two ones in the middle now with this $5 bill that I can utilize to get these coins all spread out. Uh, that should give me three total. We, if we can get one more, we can get the final prize. That would obviously be good. Final push, here it comes. Can we get lucky and get it? Of course we can. And there we go. All right, I think we'll just get the other pink fish because that's obviously going to be worth the most. Okay. Where, where, where my fish at? Oh, you threw it over by the other kid. Thanks, man. Thanks. You're, you're a real nice guy. And I've pretty much mastered this game as well. It still takes a long time to fully cover that thing, but I know the Rasta Banana is oh, worth man, I think, I 80. One of those too when I so, hell yeah, we're going to try and get another one of those. Well, we already got one of, one of those, so... What are, we, what are we working with right now? How much do we got? We got 160 bucks prize. left. Almost a full inventory of prizes already. Much better today than, than the last time. So uh, I don't think there's any other prizes that I really need. The teddy bear on the shooter game. I, you know what? I guess I could go for that just to see how much that's worth as well. Uh, just to compare. I don't see any red on it, but did I get it? Oh, yeah. That was probably my best one yet. And a well deserved. Wait, what? That isn't... I cannot see any red there. I didn't actually win. I th I swear I just assumed I did. Maybe at the bottom? Are you serious? That is ridiculous. Okay, well, we obviously got to win one more. Yeah, that actually counted. I see a little bit of red, so I didn't assume it would, considering the other one that didn't count didn't have any red, it seemed like. But hey, I'm not going to complain. I got my damn teddy bear. I'm happy. And give me that thing. That is an adorable-looking teddy bear. Yes, please. So, I think, officially, we have maxed out. You know what? This thing looks fun. Before we leave and go see how much these prizes are worth, of course, I need to try another ride. I think we got a few more ride passes. Yeah, we got three. Isn't it just like we're Superman? All right, lift up. There we go. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. I'm getting really dizzy once again. Why is every carnival ride just spinny? Like, why, why, why is that what every carnival ride goes to? Oh, God. I don't like it. I do not. Did my head just spin around? Am, am, am I a freaking owl? 
Yep, okay. This is... Where am I even now? <laughs> Jesus. Talk about a good day at the carnival. So we're gonna go over to good old berries. And, uh, this guy really likes to buy these weird things. So, of course, we're gonna sell him some more. And yeah, Barry, I have the mother load for you today, my dude. Like, seriously. Look at all this great stuff. Oh, man, we're gonna fill up the whole place with plushies. Jesus. Okay. So, I don't feel like I did that much today, but clearly I did. So, we, we had a really good day. Now, that took two credits. The Rasta man, I believe, is 80? Oh, I'm so glad we grabbed that teddy bear. Clearly, the teddy bear, if you're going for sheer profit, is the answer. I think all the rest of these are rather low. All right, you know what? We'll just, we'll just close it up. There we go. Do the first one there. And <laughs> I don't get it. Why do you buy things and then shred them? Is shredded stuffies an a, a important commodity for something? I have no idea. But would you look at that? We're already profited today, and we got all these things over here as well. So, man, definitely grab the teddy bears instead of anything else because they are sheer profit. All right, but there we go. How we do? Damn, man. We earned so much for profit today. Oh, that just feels great. All right. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Jesus Christ! Are you okay, little girl? Jeez, man. Guys in supercars are just douchebags. What the hell's going on back here? There's so many weird things in this game, like just some random broken down cars and everything. Now, this is going to be a survival game when it's fully released, which is hilarious to me. Seriously. <laughs> I wonder... Wait, what's going on? Oh, God. I'm sorry, but I love how the supercars are douchebags in this game. Look, look, look at this park job, and I, this thing's got an alarm when I get too close to it. Some fireworks, please, because I have all the money I need right now. Let's get a five-pack for 25 bucks. You're not even going to give me a deal? It's $5 each for a five-pack for 25 bucks. Okay, you know what? Screw you, buddy. I'm just going to ignite one right there. Wait for it. Coming. Oh, yeah, that's right. Right in the butt there, Frankie. What is it? Oh, Jesus. Sorry, dude. Jesus, I didn't expect it to actually explode. Frankie, yeah. All right, but... Oh, wrong one, wrong one. Grab it. Grab it before it goes. Okay, clearly I don't know how to use fireworks. So how am I supposed to... Am I supposed to put these in the ground or something? Why am I attacking my firework? I don't want to attack my firework. I just want to be able to see, too. All right, whatever. We'll just ignite it as I'm attacking it. Oh, it actually does stick in the ground. There we go. I finally got a good firework off. And isn't it beautiful? <laughs> it's actually a really cool firework. So there we go. And what if I put it in my face? There we go. Ah! <laughs> Oh, God, this is fun. All right, guys, but on that, we're going to wrap up this one here. I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the carnival once again for the coin game. Very awesome update to an already awesome game, and I'm so excited to see where this game goes. This is a bearded guy just just hanging out at the middle of the night in a, with a, at the beach with a giant duck. I love it, dude. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the rest of the carnival update. Obviously, I'll be uh, following this game as it is more developed, and uh, yeah, we'll be checking it out more as new arcades come out. The UFO arcade should be coming out soon, at least hopefully, so I'm excited to see that place because uh, we already have one amazing arcade in this. Would be nice to have two. As always, guys, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.